Hey, Gemini gang. What's happening, Geminis? Happy birthday all June 8th, Geminis. Turn up. <laughs> all right, let's see what's going on with you guys. All Gemini placements. Take what resonates with the rest. Take it how it resonates with your situation, okay? Personal readings are in the description box, you guys. There is a discount right now on 30-minute readings. Check the description box for the specials I have going on right now. Um, yeah, if you want to try Mystic Sense, check the description box for that as well. Let's see what's going on, Gemini's. Hit those likes, hit those likes, hit those likes. Wow, the energy to Zen. Hmm, interesting. I did see that reconciliation card, so... Someone may be reconciling with someone. Oh, I'm seeing soulmate. Ooh, and new love. So we have worth waiting for. Okay, it could be something you're waiting for. Someone's waiting for you, Gemini's. Engagement? Yes. New love. And then soulmates on the bottom. So let's see what's happening, Gemini's. All right. Okay, let's see what this is. Whoa, the Nine of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles, the Empress card. Okay, so interesting. Some of you may have a new person. It could be a Libra or a Taurus. It doesn't have to be. Um, but the card says a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. So is there a new energy for some of you? If it's not yet, Gemini, you may have um, a new energy coming in. I'm seeing the Three of Swords. <sighs> See the Ten of Swords as well. So, yeah, Gemini, some of you may have somebody else coming in. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else. I feel like a lot of you guys are becoming very uh, good on your own with these nines here. Nines are usually about solitude. Um, so, it's like... A lot of you guys are getting okay on your own, uh, Gemini. You're getting very comfortable on your own. Um, so it's it's going to be like, and I've told you guys in several of the one-on-ones that happy people attract happy people. So you're happy on your own. You're going to attract somebody that is in a good space like you. But always be mindful of the space that you're in when you attract someone because that person is pretty much just going to mirror back to you what energy you're in. So that's why it's always good to make sure that you're happy on your own, you're good on your own, um, and then attract someone. So it's not really about um, being totally healed, okay? Because I'm not one of those people that's, that feels like you need to be totally healed before you get into a connection. Because connections can teach you a whole new set of lessons that you can't learn on your own. But... Um, what, what state you're in mentally, emotionally, and spiritually does matter when you're attracting a partner. Whoa, ooh, you're, some of y'all soulmate is a Scorpio. <laughs> Four of cups on the bottom, yeah. Could be someone that you didn't like at first. <laughs> I got that for you guys too, quite a bit of you, um, that I don't want to say you turned down or just someone that you missed or someone that you overlooked, um, Gemini's. I know that's not going to resonate with all of you, but yeah, some of you do have someone here. Now, what I'm not sure of is, is, is this a new person? Um, because the soulmate's here. So whoever this is, is, is either loves you already or they have the, the capacity to love you uh, a lot, Gemini's. So, yeah, like I said, it could be a Scorpio or some of you. Interesting. The Ten of Wands. Mm -hmm. The Ace of Pentacles. The Page of Cups. Now, let me say this, Gemini's. I feel like a lot of you guys may have waited for someone for a very long time to the point where you are kind of tired of waiting now. Like you're not, you don't want to wait around on this person anymore. You may feel like it's it's too much. 
uh, dealing with them, Gemini, and now you're kind of wanting to see what else is out there. Um, it could also be two Gemini's with this, with this nine of cups and 10 of wands to like, be careful what you wish for. That's, that's what I'm getting here because I feel like, and I know this isn't going to resonate with everyone. Okay. Y'all are going to wait for someone to get their life together. They are going to get their life together. There are, they are going to return, but it's not going to be what you thought or your feelings aren't going to be the same, or it's going to be something different. Like you might be head over heels in love with this person, but I feel like once this person is ready and give you, give you the commitment, again, this is going to resonate with everyone. Okay. You're not going to want it, or it's not going to be what you thought it was. If that makes sense, uh, Gemini's. Yeah, seven of cups. Oh, you got options, options. <laughs> you, you, you got options. Two of cups on the bottom. Yes, Gemini. You got options, honey. I told you, happy people attract happy people. Now, some of the people you may attract aren't happy. They're not, you know, they're not as happy as you. I feel like a lot of you guys are getting to a space where you're just going to be like a fucking magnet to people. So get ready. If you're not already in this energy, you're just going to be attracting people to you. It's, it's unreal. Um, what's interesting is check and see if you have Leo in your chart anywhere because Leo is in Venus now. Uh, Venus is in Leo, I mean. And I feel like, uh, especially if you have anywhere where Leo is in your chart, you guys, that's what's going to be amplified. Uh, you're about to be getting so much fucking attention. Um... Gemini's so pay attention to that but also with with Venus with a Leo Venus it is it it makes love very dramatic you know um, you know it makes it makes it like people do like grand gestures and things like that so that's what I'm seeing here uh, Gemini's you're getting a lot of attention from people a lot of people showing interest in you Page of Wands could be someone younger than you. I keep seeing like a lot of Leo energy too. The strength card on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Something may be significant about Leo season as well uh, for some of you. So for some of you, this it may be this person offers a commitment or whatever the case may be um, in Leo season. Um, yeah, but I feel like you're going to hear from someone. Like I said, you you're going to hear from someone that loves you or. Someone that is a Scorpio or both. It's like someone is, feels like you are their person or you're their one. Um, Gemini's, but this is like after you've kind of gotten good with being on your own. That, that's, that's kind of what I'm getting. A lot of you are getting to the space of being good on your own. Being happy on your own. I'm trying to think of a way to put it. I, I think I explained it pretty good with, with the be careful what you wish for. Because I feel like you may have waited around on someone for quite some time. And then when they finally give you that offer, it's not, it, it won't be what you thought it was, Gemini's. But it's not totally a bad thing. Um, but it's it's just, this, you know, when, once you're happy with yourself and you change your energy, you look at things differently. You look at what you were attracted to differently. So the things that you were attracted to about this person, you may not be attracted to anymore, if that makes sense. Whoa, cards going everywhere. Yep, I'll take that little fortune because it's showing his face. A bunch of other cards came out. A whole bunch of other cards came out, y'all. Um, and I'm seeing that five of wands. Yeah, I told you, Gemini's. Mm -hmm. You want to get exactly what you want. I do see a change in this person, though. Yeah, there, there's going to be movement and something that you're waiting on. There's, there's going to be movement between you and this uh, and this person. It's like I feel like it's just divine timing. Uh, Gemini's the queen of wands. Oop, I told you. Child. <laughs> I told you, Gemini's the six of cups. You guys are super attractive right now. I feel like that's kind of what's going to 
like um you could also just be dealing with an Aries but I feel like for a lot of you that's what's what's gonna like put some pep in this person's step is the fact that a lot of other people are gonna be like after you like it's gonna be checking for you um, Gemini's and like I said it's all in the energy as well yeah I'm saying Gemini's you're you're getting confident there's something about you that's changing some of you are changing your your physical appearance how you look you know whether it's eating differently exercising you know you changed your hair your hair color um you know something about you has changed uh Gemini's and not even just on the physical side of it but your energy has changed Gemini's and this person is taking notice they're they noticing the new you this new vibrant energy that you have you know you're not really checking for them you're not running after them like you were you're just sitting pretty being fine sexy you know <laughs> Mm-hmm. Eight of Pentacles. <laughs> the Ace of Pentacles again. So, Gemini, this again gives me a, a, an impression that you are going to have multiple options. Multiple people wanting to be with you. Wanting to jump through hoops for you. It may not be as extreme for some of you. Some is going to be more extreme than others. But, yeah, Gemini, this, this is what it boils down to. Whoever this person is, Gemini, is, is kind of aware of the competition as well. Yeah. But two, with the Eight of Pentacles over this Empress card, it gives me the same vibe over the Nine of Pentacles as the Nine of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands as you guys working on yourselves. And the fact that you're doing that is what is attracting a lot of people to you, Gemini. And it's like I said, it's beyond the physical attraction it's like literally your energy something about your energy has shifted yeah oh baby they are coming in child the knight of swords look at that <laughs> coming facing this way coming right towards you honey the lovers on the bottom i told you i told you honey <laughs> Yeah, they're going to try to scoop you up, uh, Gemini's. I also feel like, too, this person may have needed to get a little bit more uh, comfortable with themselves, too, before they offered anything um, to you. But, yeah, I feel like this person, they be scoping you, looking, you know, seeing what you're doing and all this other stuff. And this person has, this, they notice your energy shift, but, but they're coming right towards you. No questions asked. Uh... Gemini's and I'm feeling like a sense of urgency here because like I said um, some of you got options Gemini's whether you see them or not and what's interesting too with this with this eight of pentacles card crossing these other two cards is how he's looking down focused on his work so a lot of you guys aren't even really focused on or worried about anyone else um, but you have people watching you uh, Gemini's you got people watching you. You got people interested. <clears throat> and they ain't feeling that. <laughs> I'm not the same person I've changed. I'm seeing this on the bottom. Now, this could legit be you or your person. You or this person. Because I'm seeing a change in you, Gemini's. But I do feel like this person was needing to change as well with this Wheel of Fortune. So, I'm seeing growth change with both of you. Um, Gemini's both of you needed to do that. I want to be vulnerable, but I don't know how. Mm -hmm, makes sense. <laughs> what are you hiding now? That makes sense too. With this Seven of Cups and the Empress, this person may feel like you're hiding something from them. You see, in other people, <laughs> I want to see you right now. I told you there's a sense of urgency going on here. Some of you may it may even be this weekend that you hear from this person. My life was black and white till so you came in and added color. I'm telling you, Gemini's. Twin flames. Really? That's the first time I've seen that one for you guys in a long time. I haven't seen that one in quite some time for you. I told you. I can't stop spying and checking on you. I told you, Gemini's. This person watches you. They watch and see what you're doing. They watch and see um, who you're talking to. 
I've never loved like this. Mm. I can feel you detaching from me. Didn't I say that? Child. Look at him. <laughs> I told you, Gemini's. I told you. Let me just get a couple more. <laughs> I talk to you telepathically. I can believe it. I can believe it. Stop ignoring me. Damn, some of you ignoring this person. <laughs> Single by choice. Now that could be you or them, uh, Gemini. Because I feel like y'all don't have you. You have no shortage of options. Maybe I deserve by tank. You may not see them yet, but you will. They will be. They will make themselves known. I want to do things right this time. Mm -hmm. My heart is open and I'm ready. Yeah, I bet it is. I bet it is. <laughs> On My Love by Tank. I love that song. All right, Gemini's. Thank you for watching. Hit those likes, y'all. Peace out.